everybody, it's Dara. And today I am here to tell you about my energy tonic. And in this video, I'm going to tell you what it is, why I created it, and how it's helped me and many, many other people, and also how to use it, how to use it in its simplest form and to make it more decadent and creamy. So basically, what is this? It's a coffee alternative. Um, many of us have been addicted to coffee. Many of us can't have coffee, and many of us would like to reduce our intake of coffee. And so this is hot, chocolatey, creamy, coffee-tasting drink with medicinal Chinese herbs. So why do people need to get off of coffee? Most of us know that it makes us jittery and makes us nervous and brings us up and bring, brings us down. But did you also know that it can deplete our body's nutrients? The nutrients that we put in are not as absorbable when we drink coffee and it definitely can tweak our adrenals, which are also associated with our thyroid. So we have to pay attention to our delicate, our body's delicate hormone balance. So our adrenals get tweaked out, our nervous system, and so then the other thing is that coffee also can dehydrate us, which would lead to fine lines and wrinkles, so need I say more, for beauty, for optimal health, we don't want to overdo it with coffee. And also, if you do drink coffee, just please make sure that it's organic because coffee is the most pesticide-laden produce there is. So there is the introduction to my energy tonic, which basically um, I did this because it's a blend of my favorite um, beautiful, high-quality extract of Chinese herbs with pure cacao and I'm gonna tell you the ingredients that are in it, but just know that it's a hot, nurturing, delicious drink. And I developed it because I used to drink coffee all the time. It was my morning ritual, and I like that hot, dark um, ritual in the morning. And so I would take a half hour intuiting tonic blend and doing a different one each day. And I always knew that I wanted to make it easy for other people because not everybody wants to do that alchemy every morning. Not everybody has the time to do that. And also, so not only will it save you time, it will also um, uh, save you money because buying all the ingredients that I put in here would cost over $250. This bag is $29.95 um, and it's a lot of value because there's about, depending on how much you use for each cup, uh, two to three tablespoons. It's no more than $3 a serving. It's two to three dollars a serving, which to have all this medicinal herbs in here is amazing. And there's a lot of people drinking Starbucks, which has, you know, whatever, all those kinds of coffees, which are not good for you. This is good for you. So I, oh, how does it help me? It helps me. I made notes just to make sure I covered everything because <laughs> I usually go off on a tangent in my videos. How does it help me? It's my coffee rit ritual. It gives me energy. It gives me clarity. And many people have told me that it has suppressed their appetite. They don't want to uh, eat that much after they've had it. So I'm going to tell you what is in it. We have pure cacao, we have lacuma, which gives it a butterscotchy flavor and it is the way I got it to be creamy. You're gonna um, have the finest extracts of reishi, which augments the heart chi, your heart energy. It helps your liver and your cardio function. We have chaga, which chaga mushroom is the healing mushroom. It will graft a tree back together. And it's been known people who have cancer have used it for uh, reversing symptoms, reversing disease, preventing disease. Chaga is a main one. Shilajit is a mineral, a mineral-like, tar-like substance from the Himalayas, and it helps to ground and mineralize. There's so many minerals in shilajit. We have eucomia, which is really good for the joints. We have cordyceps, which is for energy and libido. We have macuna, which uh, helps us to be happy. Uh, Eleuthero, we have roasted barley, roasted chicory, dandelion, sugar beet. Those are extracts of those things. So there's no gluten in this product. There's no gluten in here. Um, and it, that's the part that makes it taste like coffee. 
We have a little titch of yerba mate. It's the teeniest amount, but it gives you a lift. It acts as a vasodilator along with the cacao to help the herbs get to your vital organs in such a quick and efficient manner. So yerba mate also gives you mental clarity. It's not an overdose of it. It's not a strong. When I make yerba mate at home plain, I make it very weak. I just need a little bit. It has sun-dried cane juice crystals, so yes, there's sugar in it. Yes, there's minerals in the cane juice. I'm going to give you the frequently asked questions at the end of this video, so I will answer questions about that. It has pure ground vanilla bean and Himalayan pink salt that has minerals in it. Um, so, what, what do you do with this? Okay, in its simplest form, you add this to hot water. Your next best creamiest version of this is to ha add it to a hot nut or seed milk. I have one here that I found and I love it because it's organic. It's by New Barn. Um, and the reason I like this, I, I make almond milk myself, but if I'm going, these tonics are hot. I like them hot. So if I make live living raw almond milk and then I go ahead and heat it, yes, that's better than a box of almond milk with carrageenan in it or um, additives or fillers, but since I'm heating it anyway, I don't mind that this has been flash pasteurized or pasteurized. So this is almond milk and it's organic. Organic is my first choice. So I might do half a cup of this, half a cup of water, put in two to three tablespoons of this, or just a cup of water, or for creamier, a cup of almond milk, or hemp milk, or nut milk, or rice milk, or soy milk, whatever you like to use, or regular milk if that's your thing. So, um, oh, okay, so now what I'm going to share with you, which I've not shared with anyone yet, is what I do to make it extra creamy. There's certain days that I want to serve somebody something that is decadent. So I will do this and add coconut oil and blend it in the blender, or I will do almond milk, water, and coconut oil, a tablespoon. Sometimes to make it taste like a gorgeous Parisian hot chocolate, I will add, or a candy bar, I will add pure cacao butter. You can get this now at, at natural food stores or you can buy it at the Longevity Warehouse. And it's the fat from the cacao bean and adding it back in is just giving you such a creaminess. You can't imagine that anybody would ever not like this. Straight in water, but definitely this is like the wow factor. And the final, Pièce de Résistance, the thing that I've been posting on Instagram is my, they're like, it's like an energy ch tonic chino. It's a cappuccino, macchino, no coffee cappuccino. It's amazing. So uh, my friend Jenna told me about this machine that is called a Capresso. And you just put the milk in here and I'm gonna give you a tip. You use the frothing insert. It's a little thing, it's the frothing one. It's got little Sylvia on the end of it. Anyway, we put in maybe a half a cup in here and the trick is to use the middle button and the extra trick is not just to press the button once but to press it a second time to get it more frothy but keep your eye on this so it doesn't overflow. So I would say it's one and a half times the suggested button pressing. Does that make sense? You press it twice but on the second run you stand near it because I've had it overflow before. So basically um, I heat the water and while I'm doing that and frothing this milk, I will tell you the frequently asked questions and also let you know that it is possible to leave us reviews. My dear friend and collaborator and the new More with Dara site is, um, has set up a review section. So when you get a bag and you want to tell us how great it is, you can um, leave a comment and I will see all of them. So I'm just going to plug this in. I'll heat a little bit more and plug it in. Okay, so while that's going, I'm going to tell you the frequently asked questions. Uh, and one of the best things about this tonic and me making tonics throughout the day, morning, afternoon, um, is the fact that I believe it's the secret to my being able to be raw for 11 years. 
Only recently when I went traveling to Paris and London did I start making clean cooking food, but I was pretty much 100% raw for 11 years. And I do believe it's because of my tonic herbs and my hot creamy tonics. So frequently asked questions, is there sugar? Yes, there's sugar. Do I have a, uh, is it sun-dried cane juice crystals? Yes. Are there minerals in it? Yes. Um, the, bit, the herbs are bitter. You need, if you can't put a fat in here, you need to put a sweet. And I wanted it to taste good because I know a lot of you are having these creamy, not good for you drinks at coffee shops. So this is my answer to a creamy coffee drink. So it's a little sweet, but not too sweet for me. Um, there is no nutritional panel on this run. We did a very artisanal, two runs artisanally. Our next batch is going to be bigger. There will be a nutritional panel. But is this going to make me fat? And that's just the funniest question. Will that make me fat? Nothing that you have in my house is going to make you fat. It's made with love. And you need to eat it with love and drink it with love. But my question when someone asks me that is, what did you eat today? What else did you eat? Was it the pizza or that donut or the Cinnabon? Or did you have five scoops, 10 scoops of nut butter? What did you eat? If this were the thing that had the most sugar, this would be the thing to have because this is what gets the herbs. And these herbs will change your consciousness. Reishi has been known to change people's consciousness. In, it really, it's inexplicable, but it is true. So um, can I have this one pregnant? I would say yes for everything, except there's a tiji yerba mate. So you need to check with your healthcare practitioner. But I know people who take the Chinese herbs, reishi and chaga, and all of those things while pregnant. But check with your healthcare practitioner. Um, and the funniest thing really is that, you know, I haven't gotten any bags really returned. Um, and it's not like black coffee, so it's a little sweet, but there's a woman who's bought 70 bags, 70 bags. So um, that's it. This is not going to make you fat. What the rest of your diet is might, but <laughs> this is not going to make you fat. I'm going to press it another half a time. And We just heat water, tea kettle, stove, electric tea kettle. Um, I pour some water in. Now, since I'm making a cappuccino, I'm using less water so I can make it stronger. Much like if you have a real cappuccino, you're using espresso, a small, intense amount of coffee instead of, this is how you get it. This is a fresh new bag. Um, Instead of, there's a rip top, but I like it even on the top. So instead of making it full amount of water, since we have almond milk, you could use a half a cup of water, two or three tablespoons of this. And uh, I'm going to cut it low enough. <laughs> and, and that will give you a gorgeous. And that's how easy it stirs. You don't need to blend it. Two, three. There's not a guest that comes here that I don't serve a hot, creamy tonic to. It's just my thing. I love, 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 love to nurture people this way. It's nurturing. Hot, these hot herbs can warm your spleen, warm your digestive fire, so that you know the raw food diet can tend to be cold and damp. So it's nice to have these hot drinks throughout the day. So I'm keeping my eye on it. I'm going to put it in... I don't know, I like this mug. I have that in the pink mug, but I'll put the milk. It's steamed. I pour that in. Then I go serve it to my friend. Voila. I always drip a little. <laughs> it's okay. So there you have it, everybody. Your warm, nurturing, hot cup of something that is going to lift you up, lift your spirits, and not make you jittery. It will, you will not be crashing down after this. So try it. Even if you're a coffee drinker, drinker you will be pleasantly surprised. Um, let me know what you think. I love you guys. And get your tonics on. Mm -hmm.